I am so excited to be back with you for another year. Let's see what's coming up this week. You guys have been playing a new game these last few weeks and I am loving it. It's called Fact of the Week. So let's see what fact I have for you this week. Okay, are you ready? So, which can run faster? A hippo or a human? Hmm, I wonder. What do you think? That's correct, it's a hippo. Well done, guys. So this week for worship, we are gonna join our worship team as we sing a song called So Will I. And I want you to listen out for what it says about God and what He means to us. Okay guys, so let's stand to our feet and let's listen out for this song. was that song what were the favorite bits of the song for you hmm great okay well my favorite bit was when it said that God created us in his image 
And so in Genesis 1, 27, it says that God created human beings in His image. In the image of God, He created them. He created them male and female. Wow, I love that verse. And what we can see today is from the song and from the Bible that God made us in His image. And that I know for me, God has made me loving and kind. And you are too, because God has made you in His image. And so I wanna challenge you today. How do you see God? How has God made you great and made you in His image? So this week for Faith at Home, we are going to look at how God has done amazing things for us. And so you can write a list or you can write a song, whatever you feel is best. And my second question for you this week is how has God made you great? Are you a great footballer? Are you a great brother or sister? Well, I want you to look at those things during the week and constantly remind yourself how God has made you great. So do you guys want to join me as we pray? Why don't you put your hands together or close your eyes and let's talk to God. Dear God, thank you that you have made me in your image and that you have made me great. In Jesus name I pray, Amen. So this week's game is called Guess the Picture and I am so excited. But wait, first, before we play the game, I need you to go and find some paper, some pens, some coloring and stuff, whatever to draw or write with. Quickly, go find it. Okay kids, are you ready? So you need to draw or write down whatever you see. Okay, should we get the first picture? Let's see. Hmm, what is this picture? Can you guess it? What do you think? Okay, should we make it less blurry? Okay, what do you think? What is it? Hmm, okay, should we reveal the picture? Are you ready? Do you have it drawn or written down? Okay, yes, it's a giraffe! Well done, kids. Okay, are you ready for our second picture? Okay, well, let me give you a clue. It's got to do with a song that we started with earlier. You ready? Okay, let's see this picture. Hmm, what is it? Do you know? Hmm, that shape, what, what's that shape? Okay, should we unblur it a little bit? Yeah, let's unblur it. Oh, wow. Can you guess what it is? Can you draw it? Okay, are you ready? Great, let's see what it is. Yeah, it's some stars! Well done, kids! Okay, ready for picture number three? Okay, let's see what it is. Oh! What's round? Hmm, a soccer ball? A tennis ball? I don't know, what do you think it is? Okay, should we unblur it a little bit? Okay. Oh! What's that? Hmm, well I'll give you a clue. What's round and got to do with God's creation? Hmm, I wonder. Okay, have you drawn it? Have you written it down? Should we reveal it? Are you ready? Have you got this one right? Okay, let's see what it is. Yeah, it's a world! Well done, kids! You are great! So 
this week's memory verse we have already looked at and it comes from Genesis 1 27 and it says so God created human beings in his image and so this memory verse just reminds us how God has created us in his image and how he has made us great I have loved being with you today for Kids Church Online and I can't wait to join you next time. If you need any more information, ask your families to go to this website link, lifechurchhome.com forward slash kidschurch and on there you can find more of the videos and our Seek First devotional. See you next time. Bye kids!